Oh, Lord. Lord, y'all know. Oh, you know, people can be so low down, um, so low down, so low down. And I guess I've been uh, getting a real good drip of it as I've been listening to uh, the grand jury um, and the trial with uh, Nipsey Hussle. It is so sad and pathetic how um, jealousy and envy uh, do individuals because y'all can sit there and talk about Dr. Sabi and make it all this conspiracy and all that if you want to. That wasn't nothing but some plain nigga crap, as uh, some more would say. You already know what that was. That was the most hatefulest disrespectful uh, and I've been list reading some of the testimony from people that were there um, and um, who are traumatized this is so much trauma so much trauma living here in America uh, it's, it's just really a really uh, traumatic place and um i just don't think that a lot of people even i mean those of us who are american and unless we get to travel abroad most of us don't want to come back here because you can feel the tension the closer you get to america uh america is not what it's cracked up to be you know uh, but I was just saying, I've been listening to the transcripts and the testimony from that trial. And um, all I can say is, you know, rest in power, young man. What happened to you is what happens to um, 95, maybe 98% of the brothers. Um, envy, jealousy, and nigga shit. It's the same reason I lost my brother. I mean, it's the same reason a lot of mother buried their sons. Uh huh. The 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 madness of greed, jealousy. Envy, toxic male um, mindset, and just being overall traumatized. I'm going to get you because you got me. And like I said, emotionally, we can only go two questions deep if we can go that far before somebody get hurt. And um, it's really, really bad when you got to live amongst people like that. Nipsey's death was um, no different than what I see happen at these gas stations and uh, parking lots every day with what we do to each other. And it's so sad. It's so sad. And now he left children without a father. And the thing about it is most of y'all don't even care about that. I saw a man about to shoot a guy that was holding his baby, the baby would sleep on his shoulder. And he had a pistol pointed at him, about to shoot, but the gun jammed. He had no remorse, no thought process of anything. Uh, we used to didn't be that kind of people, but we are now. And um, I think it's more like a zombie-like behavior. And, you know, anyway... Rest in power, Nip. And, um, whew. That, that, that guy gonna get just what he got coming to him. I'll see you in the next video.